I'm going to make a 2K lineup out of this playing card deck. Now, this is an NBA 2022 to 2023 card pack deck from Panini, and I'm really excited to open it and share with you guys. I've been getting into trading cards lately. I've been getting into sports playing cards again. I used to have a lot of playing cards when I was a kid. My mom found like half of my collection, so I would love to make more content around this stuff. So if this is something that you like, feel free to give this video a like. It's free and it helps out the channel. So without further ado, let's get to unpacking. So there are 15 cards inside. So first up, we have Keldon Johnson right here. Next up is Tyrese Halliburton. I'm excited for this. And then we have Jonas Valanciunas. Good big right there. Brandon Boston Jr. Then we have Christian Wood right here. Ooh, this is a big card here. Anthony Davis. Valanciunas, Christian Wood, Anthony Davis. All right. Next up, we have Kennedy Chandler, Evan Mobley. We might go 82 and 0 here, guys. Definitely might go 82 and 0 here because we just picked out Trey Young. I know you know who this is. This is Kyrie Irving. Good backcourt. Halliburton, Young, and Kyrie. Then we got DeAndre Hunter. We have Cam Reddish right here. And then we have Jalen Williams from the Thunder, followed by Jeremy Sohan. This is a special card here. I don't What is this? This is like, like cloth. It's like the, the Spurs jersey or something, maybe. Who knows? Interesting. And finally, last but not least, I did not expect to pick a player of this magnitude. We got LeBron. This seems like a really exciting team. So let me go in and build the roster right quick. All right. So I found every player in 2K except for Kennedy Chandler. I looked through the G League teams as well, but I don't think that it's going to matter because we're playing 13 players anyway. So Brandon Boston Jr. is our reserve. Now we have a lineup of Halliburton at the one. Irving at the two, Johnson at the three, James, Anthony Davis, Trey Young, Evan Mobley. There's part of me that wants LeBron at the three and then Evan Mobley, Anthony Davis, but I don't mind this lineup as well because I think if we look at the rotation timeline, it's gonna be fine. As you see here through the lineup, they're gonna have the starters and then Kyrie will play along with Trey Young, Evan Mobley, Valanciunas, and DeAndre Hunter, which is fine. And then Trey Young will play with Halliburton at the two, Kellen Johnson, LeBron, and Anthony Davis. I like this rotation a lot. There's not much, they're gonna put Jeremy Sohan. Actually, with what we're doing, I don't think there's a need to play 10 players. Bench step, nine players, for sure. Yeah, nine players, I think this makes for a cleaner rotation. I don't need Jeremy Sohan playing when I got three point guards and LeBron can do everything. I think this is fine. Let's see, let's see if that works. Let's see how this works. I'm expecting us to do very well. Now, will we go 82 and 0? Nope, we're, oh God, we lost three in a row. This team lost three in a row. We lost to the Heat. All right, let's see how this team's playing together. Pistons, Trey Young, Kyrie. oh no. I thought that this team was very solid, but apparently not. Maybe this team is gonna get crucified in the boards. I don't know, but that shouldn't happen either. Oh, this probably was a team chemistry thing. We lost by 42 to the Charlotte Hornets. Let's examine this. Oh my goodness. What? 2K, what is going on? That's crazy. All right, let's get the let's get the wins back here. Yeah, win, win. Loss to the Sixers. Loss, loss. Oh my goodness. Nine and six. Okay, there's a W. Are we hitting our stride finally? Maybe we have too many point guards. I have no idea what's going on. All right, there we go. We're getting our wins up. Ooh, they have a Brunson Mitchell Robinson trade. Dude, if we weren't in the simulation, I think I would do this trade easily. Kellen Johnson's hurt. Now I have adjust the rotation. Now we're okay. Getting some losses in here, man. Interesting. Beat the Jazz. Oh my goodness. Yep. Halliburton out for a month, maybe? Oh, but we got Trey Young and Kyrie, so I think they'll, they'll be able to take over the reins. I mean, this is not a, this is a very talented and deep team, 23 and 10. All right, so we have De'Aaron Fox and C. Jones for Trey Young and Christian Wood. No, but we're gonna, we're gonna pause here. We're 24 and 11, 25 and 11 here. But I'm trying to figure out why we're not better than we should be. I feel like our weakness is probably in inside. Our player stats, look at the Kyrie and LeBron, Trey Young leading the team, points and assists, Halliburton in, the Halliburton injury is big, but I feel like, oh, that makes this team very undersized defensively. Maybe we're not a good defensive team. If we got Halliburton Young and, Trey Young has made a lot of defensive strides this year, but Halliburton and Irving next to him probably is probably not ideal. All right, so Pistons, number three, number five offense in the league. No, Pistons have a number, Pistons have a top five defense as well with a, 
but the Grizzlies are nuts. Okay. This Grizzlies team is pretty good. It sucks that they're missing like 13 players this year. <laughs> A point differential of 20. Good Lord. All right. Timberwolves too. I guess no one's. Well, look at our team. Yeah. What is wrong? What is, going what is going on with our offense then? All right. Do we have a top five offense? No, we don't. We don't have a top five offense. We have a, oh, we have a mid offense. Oh no. How does a team with all these players have a mid offense, bro? Baffling to me, honestly. Let's get to the front office. Let's make LeBron a small forward. Yeah, let's make LeBron a small forward and then power forward second year position because he has no reason to be. I feel like that's probably our change that we have to make because there's no reason for him to. We can play LeBron over Keldon and that upgrades our starting lineup a lot. Yeah, no, this is better. And then when Tyler and then Halliburton comes back, we can play this team. Yeah, that's fine. Right. I think that's better. That's the adjustment I'll make. See how that works. Loss win. OK, Harry Halliburton is back. Yep. Beat the Wizards. Timberwolves beat the Timberwolves. So, yep. Yeah, now our now our hot now our offense is like super high scoring. One hundred one thirty seven. But we're giving a lot of points up some days. Ooh, loss to the Bucks. Yep. One forty seven. One twenty. Yep. Trey Young out. But we adjust. We move on. Loss to the Cavs. Is our team not as complete as we think it is? I'm trying to figure this out. Honestly. Oh, Valanchunas hurt. There we go. See, when we're good, we're good. 136 to 87. We got, we got all the team. Ooh, look at that. 149, 144. Look at that. Beating the Clippers by that much. Okay, now we're back. We're, we look, we seem to be back. Beating the Pacers. We're on a win streak now. 41. There we go. Look at that. We can't, we can't lose now. Ooh, beat the Cavs too. Beat the Magic. Oof, lost to the Heat. We keep losing, or do we keep losing to the Heat? Do we match up with some teams poorly? I'm trying to figure that out. 50, 51. 51. Oh. Celtics are really good though, so that's fine. We didn't take any Cel we didn't take any of the Celtics players, so they're still a really good team on paper. So that's a team I'm worried about. That in Denver. We lost to the Wizards. Hold on a second. Hold on, bro. Marvin Bagley, 237. When we're off, when we're off as a team, we're just off. LeBron Stinker, 8, 7, and 6. Anthony Davis, 10, 7, and 2. Five blocks, though. I feel like maybe when the playoffs happen. Oh, Valentin, it's a bad time to get the flu. Playoffs are about to start. He's 7 and 21. 8 and 24. So we're 58 and 24. I don't think that makes us first in the conf. Lucum MVP. Ray Young, sixth man of the year, because, yeah. And I know that when you stack a team like this, everyone's everyone's uh stats take a hit for sure but that makes us the number one seed of course but let's check the stats here i feel like it's so weird this year our points per game now we're the number one offense at the end of the at the end of the year when it's all said and done have the highest differential yep and we were the number four defense so yeah, we got a good point differential. I'm very confident in our chances this year. We also tied the Clippers for the most wins. Now, field goal percentage was fine. Three point percentage. Oh, we didn't take. Do did we not take a lot of threes? Oh, we probably middle of the pack there. And then three point percentage for the Pistons here. Thirty six percent free throws. Do we get the foul line a lot? Yeah, we do. We get the free throw line a lot. But the good free throw percentage too. Offensive rebounding, bad. That's bad. Offensive rebound percentage, however, is the Clippers is 60% offensive rebounding percentage. That just sounds like 2K, bro. That's out of whack. Rebounding, we're the second best rebounding team. The first, we're first in assists because we have Halliburton Young. Deals per game, pretty low on that. And blocks per game, we're, we're leading the league. Turnovers per game. No, we're fine. Fouls per game. We don't foul. This Celtics team is crazy. Bench points per game. We got the third on that. So I feel like, so we've made a team that's good, but formidable for sure. Formidable for sure, man. But I think we still have a, we still have a shot. All right. We're playing a Cavs team and that should be, yep. All right. Detroit versus Boston. Boston's a four seed. With this lineup, they're a four seed. That's... Wow, because they're, oh, their bench has not been done any favors. Oh, man, that's just them. Let's see if we can get, oh, go sweep of Boston? Okay, okay. Now we got New York. Yeah, let's see what New York looks like. Brunson, Dimitri, a newbie. If we, we shouldn't lose that. One and six, and then we have the Suns, man. Okay, Booker, Durant, Beal. They're starting Bowl Bowl. Nurkic hurt? Where is Nurkic? Oh, no. Did they trade for him? Did they trade him? Let's go game 
Kyrie sore left knee. Oof, that's that rotation. All right, game two, does it matter? Does it matter? Oh, the Suns win game two. Oh, he's fully healed. Let's do that. Okay, game three. Yep, yep. Oh, we, we might be. Tyrese Halliburton's out for the season with a cut on the head? Bro, what? I hope the season's over. Oh, no. Oh, that fully healed. Okay, cool, cool, cool. And we won. Let's go. LeBron James, MVP. 26.5, 7 and 5, 11 assists. LeBron averaging 11 assists in the postseason. Hell yeah, look at that. Let's view the box scores here. Despite Devin Booker having 45 in game six, it was not enough. Game one, LeBron, Trey Young was on the court. 17, 14, LeBron 22 and 14. Really balanced team over here, beating them by 26. Game two, loss of the Suns in overtime. Kyrie had 42, LeBron 25 point triple double, Halliburton 16 and 15. So it seems like this team is choosing Halliburton to play over Trey Young. Like you can play either of them and be fine, but Trey 10, 5, and 7. Game three, absolute beatdown. Trey Young 18 and 16. Halliburton 23 and 14. Okay, there there it is. I'm expecting, I was expecting like more of that. And then game four, 30, 24, 8, and 8, 13 and 16, Trey Young 13 and 7. Solid teams. Now the Suns beat us a lot with 140, 20 and 12, 51 from Devin Booker. Devin Booker's trying his best not to lose these games. And I gotta commend him for it. He showed up 17 for 19. And then game game six was just not. I use Halliburton said enough. 33 points. LeBron 25, 9, and 14. Trey Young 25, 4, and 6. And so, so yeah. Shout out to Panini for this card pack. This pack was full of talented guards and we had Anthony Davis and Evan Mobley to bolster up the front court along with LeBron. If you put LeBron in 2K, he's gonna be a nightmare every time. So thank you guys for watching to the end of the video. Feel free to like, comment, and subscribe. And shout out to Panini. Hopefully I'm able to get more card packs so I can make more videos like this. I was really intrigued because I didn't know who would actually be in these card packs. I, I didn't know if it was actually gonna be like, all-stars or like rookies or whatnot but so that that element of surprise was really fun to me but thank you guys so much and i will see you guys later